All men are created equal, but not all burgers. And this brings us to Joe's Cable Car in San Francisco at the corner of Silver and Mission, where this dude's been knocking it out of the park for over 40 years with something you and I would call a burger, but he insists it's fresh ground steak. I mean, look at it. It's juicy, melts in your mouth. What are you going to do? You got to eat. It's unique. It has a unique taste. It was great. Everything was fresh. Big, thick, and juicy. Top with just about anything. I got mine with an egg. It's great. There's a really good variety here. The best burger I think I've ever tasted. Mushrooms and Swiss cheese. We've got 11 different cheese, three different sizes, a four ounce, a six ounce, and a righteous eight ounce. You're going to be able to finish all that? I don't if know. If you don't call me, I come back. I'm stopped. This is the best burger in San Francisco. And it's this guy's passion. I know what the burger is made of. Look at that thing. I got a patty mail. Armenian native Joe Abiji came to America in 62. And ever since, he's been making the all-American burger. Basically, if I don't eat it, I won't serve it. He bought the place 42 years ago. And he's here so much, it feels like home. You welcome. The neon, the lights. It's like, welcome to Little Vegas. What is the theme? Just make it cheerful. Oh, it is cheerful. It cheers me up every day. Holy neon arama. Welcome to Joe's. Welcome to Joe's Addicted Burgers. Yeah. Now, are you always in the dining room doing this, walking around talking to people? Six days a week. Six seven, days six, a week. Seven days yeah. in California. And how do you like it cooked? Today I had the teriyaki burger. I got the pizza burger. How a patty milk are amazing. I did not add anything. I take it the way Joe serves it. Cheddar, cheddar, cheddar. It's a really delicious burger. Everybody happy? Yeah. The meat is uh, the star. And to make it right, he insists it's all about cutting it fresh. Top grade. Choice B. I don't like to uh, use the word burger because then it messes everybody's brain. It's juicy. Real ground beef. And it's trimmed and ground fresh every day right in a restaurant. Seeing that guy over there with that little hook and that knife and just carving and then it goes right in that grinder and plops right on that grill. They're all chuck roll. They're all chuck roll. Ready? Go. What fat ratio are we trying to get, fat to meat? By the time we cook it, you wind up with 6 to 8% fat. So you're getting, contrary to the belief that 80-20 is the premium grind for a burger, but if you're using the best meat, then you don't have to worry about that fat level. No. OK, well, let's grind. So we look inside this, we really get meat. We get actual chewable pieces of meat, not not mashed and processed. I mean, you actually, and that's why it's steak burger, because it's actually got texture, meat texture to it. And when you bite into it, you have uh, more flavor, more juice. The meat had flavor. It was so fresh. It doesn't taste like you wonder what else is in it. So where's the patty machine? That's the patty machine. You're the patty machine. Let me see that thing. Yeah. All right. Wow. No, the magic starts. This is when the magic happens? Yeah. So that's how it gets made. Wow, that's a lot of meat. We're gonna flatten this, right? Yeah. Press it down. Shape it up. That's it. Just give it a little love. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Press it again. You go like that, and, and so you get it tight together. And now just pick it up. The wax paper is not even big enough, Joe. Second time's when I give it the smack down. Yeah. You put it down and. Mm -hmm. Did you do this game? <laughs> All we do uh, is uh, go. What do we do now? Sing? You sing, you bless it. You bless it? Yeah. Most people go like this. All bless. I think that's just when they're trying to keep their hands warm. <laughs> Joe, I'm ready to flip when you are. Yeah, OK. Watch this. Don't try this at home. Don't try it. Oh. That's bananas. Bananas is good. What? All the juice. Crispy bacon. A little bite of that bite from that onion. I like the teriyaki. That's a lot of avocado. Anything that has to do with pizza sauce. Number one. Number two, the Joe. The onion's inside. Number three, the patty milk. Or maybe one, two, three. But anyhow, these are my top three. Okay, I'm gonna go take a nap. All right, let me get you the blanket. Please, I'm right here. Yeah. What is the number one seller? The basic one. Next is the bacon burger. Then mushroom, patty melt, and avocado. Throw in all the others, and Joe sells up to 2,000 burgers a week. Really delicious burger. So fresh. Everything was so fresh. You walk in, and you see there's history. And you say, if it survives this long, 
That's it. That's what I love doing. Because if it has been here this long, you know that is that people have been coming here for a reason. Thank you so much. You want that today? Yeah, right Tell me, uh, you know, Joe, uh, are you going to retire? When are you going to retire? And I was just, what do I do? I'm going to go crazy because this is my social life. So he'll be here. How far can you get your arm down there? Grinding out some of the best burgers on the bay and doing it the same way he always has for 42 years. Why do you do it? I really enjoy seeing the smile on with every bite. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Well, that's it for this trip. But don't worry. I'll be looking for you at America's greatest diners, drive-ins, and dives.